Hey guys, welcome back to Yokai Watch 3, and last time I asked you guys to decide for us. Are we Team Sushi or Team Tempura, baby? And by a landslide, Sushi won. Come on, Team Tempura, you didn't even try. Anyways, we're going with our food of choice being sushi. Oh, my swirls. You've understood us. Uh, why not order separately if you can't decide together? Uh, yeah. dude, I don't wanna. That's gross. Meow. Yeah. No, not my, not my swirls. <laughs> that is not roll off the tongue, Yan. Uh, let's do sukiyaki then. And please everyone, Yan. I don't think that's gonna please anyone, Japan Yan. Y y that wasn't an option. Sorry. Sounds good to me, meow. My swirls. Sukiyaki time. <laughs> I guess I was wrong? Uh, that settles it then, I guess? Thank you for your help, Swirls! Sorry about the fuss. <laughs> it's okay, guys? Hi there. Uh, Bye there. There they go. What was all that about? I don't even know. That was not in the version of the game I played, that's for sure. Anyways, we got Key Quest to do! And I'm not gonna lie, this isn't my favorite part of the game. It's actually a little bit dull, but we gotta do it anyways. Oh, it's hopeless. I can't walk another step. Not good. He's ready to keel over. Uh, are you okay? About it, son, I say. Would it be well to help protect the peace? <laughs> Would you like to become a police officer? Because <laughs> I could use your help. Uh, man, this is really unethical. But sure, I'll protect the world, I guess. Thank you, son. I'm mighty grateful. See, the truth is, I'm so gosh darn hungry, I can't move. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry, what? Uh, I ordered some lunch ages ago, but it still hasn't arrived. It's already time for my patrol, but I'm so famished, I can't go another step. Yo, I feel you, dude. But there's like a restaurant right across the street. Come on now. Nate, this sounds like an emergency. If he can't go on patrol, then how can he protect the peace? This is where I need your help, son. I want you to get the pizzeria and see what happened to my order. Uh, okay, don't worry, I got this. I knew I could rely on you, son. Bless your heart. Uh, my order with the pizzeria up in the North Let's Beach. Go. Then we must arrive. I heard that once. Come on, Nate. The town's safety depends on us. You know, he could just call on the phone. They have a phone number. You could... Whatever. Let's get to it, I guess. Check on the bottom screen long enough, and the arrow will eventually lead you to the North Beach Pizzeria. And once we arrive inside, we'll see what's going on with the pizza here. Gosh darn it. Of all the things that I had to happen. Why are you speaking with a French accent when you're Italian? Uh, do what? Um, and, uh, uh, bonjouro! Sorry, but we at the pizza right now. The, uh, aren't you a pizza place? How could you run out of pizza? Now we have the uh, technical difficulties. Our bacon is uh, not crisp up to, y y you know. Do uh, you, you, you really need crispy bacon? What? Without the crispy bacon topping, I cannot make it a mama pizza! Uh, well, this fellow's accent is obviously fake, and if there's that set on his Mamma Mia pizza, we need to crisp up that bacon. Otherwise, it doesn't look like he'll give us a pizza. And no pizza, no protecting the peace. Yeah, crime would be bad! Uh, given BBQ's nickname, I think there might be a yokai here who could crisp up some bacon? Uh, That's an awfully optimistic conjecture. Oh uh, 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 wait, no, hold on, there is an American yokai called Salty Bacon. So basically, there's a yokai who can do exactly what I just said, huh? Uh, moving on, uh, don't think about how convenient that is. Salty Bacon haunts marvelous meats in the warehouse marketplace. Uh, this little piggy will go to the market and search for salty bacon, I guess. Yeah, let's head over there. <laughs> this is so ridiculous, guys. Head back to where we just literally were when we got the ice cream, and there it is, a lot of meat. We're bound to find salty bacon somewhere in a place like this. But where? Hmm. Well, you should know by now that yokai like to change form. So if you need something that looks out of place, get your watch and search it. Okay, this is only my third game. I should already know how to do this as Nade, but uh, yeah, this meat was moving around and it was really peculiar. Also, I know that this guy is here because this is a walkthrough. Yeah, <laughs> here he is, Salty Bacon, who I gotta say has a pretty funny name. It's like a double entendre. 
Hey, looking to bring home the bacon, are uh, ya? Uh, could, could you lend me a hand with something real quick? I'm gonna make you pay, cause I'm feeling stumpy. What? I just... What did I do? Okay. Simmer down now. It's two against one. We got two yokai. He ain't got no yokai. We got this, baby. Oh, no, wait. We got three yokai now. That's all right. We got Stravignon. All right. Food yokai versus food yokai. But not in every single battle is there going to be just one yokai to take down. When there are multiple yokai all around, make sure to pinpoint them. And sometimes a wisp will come to the battlefield to pinpoint that. And you can get some cool bonuses. But this time around, we don't need none of that. Just get them, boys. He can't be... Oh, gosh. What? No, if you use fire against him, he gets stronger. Crap, I didn't realize that. Um, That is really, really funny. Wow, he's actually completely resilient to fire. That's kind of unique. But since he's a D-rank Yoka, I don't know. He's, he's just not that powerful. No way. You slice it. <laughs> Get it? Meat. Anyway, give us some, because we beat you. We got nothing. Darn it. How unfortunate. Oh, well. Not the end of the world. Hey, we beat you. Can you help us out with this pizza? Yeah, tough. Nothing worse than tough and chewy bacon. Yes, me friends. Or crisp me up good and proper. Salty bacon! <laughs> He's so mad, dude. Who, who upsets you this much? Salty bacon's info was out of the medallion, but I gotta say, his medal is actually pretty cool. I have it. <laughs> it's neat artwork. You can't see it that well on that screen. I'll show you later. So... Give me a shout if you need me to save your bacon! Okay, this lady has just been pacing around. What does this old lady want? Uh, well done. Looks like you've made a new yokai friend. By force! I sure did! Yes. Oh yes, before I forget, let me give you this up. Okay, yokai huh? spots. Yokai spots? Mm. You've done this before, Nate. Come on. It's an app that tells you all about uh, various yokai that are hiding around town. It's kind of cool. Check it out if you have a moment. Can you tell me about this earlier? I did in the last game. Uh, you made friends with Salty Bacon anyway, didn't you? Why are you complaining? Anyway, let's get to the pizza chef. Right. Yeah, yeah. On it. What is up with you, lady? You're just gonna walk away now? <laughs> there she goes. Anyways, I guess I'll do the same. Hey! Pizza for Tony! We got your barbecue for you. We brought salty bacon, now what? Making mint spirit the pizza chef doesn't sound like a hot idea. That'd probably just crisp the chef and do nothing for the bacon. Hold on, Nate, I'm sensing a strong aura here in the shop. Give this place a good search with the yokai watch. Uh, there's an aura here? Okay, I'll give it a shot. I mean, what else do we really have to lose at the end of the day? Uh, yeah, there's something like around here. <gasps> It's one of those board thingies that I forgot existed because they weren't in blasters. Baffle board. That's the name. At least the English one, anyways. Uh, what the? A baffle board? Uh, what now? Aww. Come on, don't tell me you've forgotten. The second game wasn't that long ago. You gotta solve the yokai quiz that's written on the board, silly. If you answer correctly, then it opens up a mysterious thing called a yokai hotspot. <laughs> Is this gonna be another lecture? Shut up, it's good for you, you know? Now listen here, the quiz is the- We got this, answer the quiz, the yokai hotspot will activate and we can solve the problem. Why exactly? Because. Be because? Because I don't know, okay? <laughs> no doubt there's something marvelous will happen as a result. I mean, you don't even know. And you're mad at me for forgetting. It, at least I remember the basics, all right. Anyways, there's no arguing. Hurry up and solve the quiz. Baffle boards are part of side quests. Use the radar mode and check them out. And sometimes crazy crud will happen. Yeah, like in this scenario, we will have the ability to finish the quiz. Here's a quiz for you. He's a shady tribe. He's always angry and looks like a piece of bacon. Gee, I wonder who this could be. Have you answered anything but salty bacon? Guess what? You're wrong! But I'm right! Huzzah! It was Salty Bacon, and with his power combined, we can... Uh, in spirit, this sl slice of pizza. Since we just befriended him, this will be a piece of a wrong food. <laughs> uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Bring him out to the yokai hotspot and let's get cooking. Although the pizza's already cooked, so... Uh, yeah, right. just summon him by standing on top of it. It's pretty simple. That's right. Here we go, let's... Give it a shot, I guess, and summon this salty bacon dude. Why the crud not? And we immediately get off the yokai hotspot. Come on out, my friend! Calling salty bacon! Yokai metal, do your thing! 
Hey! There he is. It's all shady stuff, I guess. Can you do us a favor, bro? Fry it and dandy! You better explain the situation to Salty Bacon and get him to make the bacon on his pizza nice and crispy. You literally just explained it. He heard you, literally. He's an earshot. Does Salty Bacon have ears? Uh, okay, uh, S Salty Bacon, can you help us? What is it? I need you to make the bacon on the pizza crispy. Crispy? I can do that. Thanks. Uh, thank you? <laughs> I guess we got literally the guy for the job. Excuse me, sir. Have you cooked the pizza already? Uh, no, sir. I mean, no, sir. I still ain't getting nothing but flimsy or rubby bacon. Uh, what? What? <laughs> it seems the salty bacon is powerless when he's not feeling eh, salty. Ah! Uh, crap, what do we do then? Um, you think a yokai called salty bacon could at least manage this? What'd you say? <laughs> that comes useless to you. I'll show you! A little reverse psychology can go a long way. He's crisping it up now. I hope this works. Eh. Or the law enforcement's not gonna be helpful here. Well, not in tarnation. My bacon's gone crispier than a rusty morning. I mean, mama mia, what a delicious look at bacon. Time to get a baking. Okay, we did it. The quest to get a piece of cooked is so difficult, apparently. You tricked me! Yeah. Sorry, buddy. Uh, anyway, can you give us this pizza, buddy? Um, How about it? Would you like a pizza, little boy? There will be a baked soon. With this bacon, I can bake lips, smacking Mamma Mia pizza. Uh, We've come to get some pizza, actually, for a police officer. Don Tootin? I mean, is that a so? <laughs> he cannot make up his accent. Mamma Mia, then you must hurry. I'm trusting you with the delivery, even though you're not the guy who delivered. I'll get a worker right away. One bag of pizza coming right Let's up! Go. Good job. Let's hurry back to the police officer before it gets cold. No. Ah, this pizza smells delicious. I, I do not bite it, Nate. Wait. Don't get eating it, will you? I'll draw the walk and get to. Gosh. Yeah, so now we got this side quest basically done. Even though it's not a side quest, we literally have to do this to advance in the game. How about that? Hi there, sir. We got your pizza. Oh, no, I'm not a room with bacon. Is that a piece at long last? You reckon you can give me that crispy bacon pizza? I mean, yeah, yeah, here you go, bro. Just let us finish the key quest if you'd be so kind. Oh, you done good, son. Eat this faster and I'll get out. <laughs> what excellent uh, manners. I want my pizza myself. Uh, uh, I feel alive again. There ain't nothing more satisfying than a pizza when you're hungry, boy. I ain't got no idea where you done got that crispy bacon. Good job, son. You're a good citizen for helping me get back on patrol. Good luck on your patrol, officer. Thank you kindly. Mm. Who would have thought a boy armed with a bacon pizza could help serve justice and make BBQ a safer place? Don't over-exaggerate, Whisper. <laughs> for real. All right, so one key quest down, two more to go. Yeah. I wonder if there's a sink in the videos again after you beat missions. I don't think so. I actually can't remember, crud, but now that we've finished this quest, we'll not only get an item, but a try at the wheel bonus! Spin the wheel. It's really slim chances that you're gonna get first prize. I don't even know why this is in the game, but it is. I guess it's fitting in with the whole American dream idea, or at least some people's versions of the American dream. But anyways, back so what we were doing before, we still got more key quests to solve. And according to our quest log, this should be the location of the next one. The man besotted by boxes. Okay, hi. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of boxes. Hi there, sir. Hello there, boy. <laughs> uh, howdy? Son, you look like an inquisitive child. Mighty curious, ain't you? You're just the sort of boy I've been looking for. I can see your fingers thirsting to prize lids from closed crates and caskets. I know a fellow box enthusiast when I see one. Yes, sorry, I do. Uh, yeah, I, I, all these options mean yes. All right, yeah, I, I might like a box or two. I'm a, I'm so full of box-shaped curiosity, am I right? Not so. From today, we're gonna be best box buddies. 
box buddies. Okay. I don't like this one bit. There's eccentric, and then there's this guy. To commemorate our meeting, I need to make a little secret arrangement with you. Now, don't get your crows in a running. I ain't nothing to be scared of. Okay, I'm down. Spoken like a true box enthusiast. It's like we're done destined to meet. Now, this little agreement of ours has got to stay strictly between us, you hear? So, have you come inside? We can talk in private, like... This is a bad idea! Nobody, nobody do this! This is teaching children awful tendencies. Holy... What's with all the secrecy? Do not ever do this if anyone ever... Yokai watch, the heck? Well, I guess we should hear him out at least. Uh, okay. Gosh, this is... Scary. Let's head inside Mr. Box's house, I guess. What the dump is this? This dude's... This dude's cray-cray. I don't... It's a nice house, but man, you really like boxes, buddy. Welcome to my humble home. I got a little something here I want to give you. Okay, a treasure map. Sick. <laughs> Why do you have this? It's a treasure map. Nah, I bet that's tickled your fancy. <laughs> a treasure map? Cool. I don't... What? Huh? That's a really cruddy place to have a treasure. It's right over there. What? No better than some. But that gets you out of bounds, and ain't it? Uh, you bet. Find the X on the mark by the map. Who knows what you might dig up? Look it down in the lower right corner, son. You see something? Yeah, an X near that car. I should probably go there. Nate, haven't we been this place before? Yeah, now you mention it. It doesn't seem familiar somehow. Looks like it might be right to bank on you, son. I just know you can find it. At this rate, I'm sure you'll find all the treasure next in no time. Yeah, so another big thing about Yokai Watch 3 is treasure hunting. Why? I don't know. Now I got one more gift for you, son. Treasure hunting app. Well, how do you know about the Yokai pad? What? It's the treasure hunt app. An app will darn useful for your treasure hunting. Yes, sir, Bob. <laughs> Marvelous treasure hunting like pirates roving the seven seas. Right you are, Mr. Pillow Poltergeist. What? You, you can see me? So what are you waiting for, son? Grab your map and get out to that treasure. Uh, okay. That's cool. There are treasure chests hidden all over BBQ. To find them, you need treasure maps. These maps can be tracked down as well. Cool. So, yeah, and once you get to a treasure chest, you have to play a mini game. I'm not gonna lie. It's a really, really cool thing. You don't see a lot of games with the whole treasure hunting aspect to them that are RPGs. Don't know why it's an American game, though, but hang on, Nate. I swear the place we saw might be on the map. Yeah, yeah. I know where I know where I'm going, Whisper. It's straight up right there. Let's have a hard look at that map. We, we, we get it. it it's, it's near the car. Oh, yeah. The treasure must be there. Ta-da. So we're near the green car, yes. Yes! Whisper! <laughs> you don't need to sound it out for me, gosh. Yeah, it's right there. We found a treasure map. Let's find the treasure, which is really simple to solve. All you gotta do is tap the button and get rid of this dude's teeth. It's a little it's a little unfortunate, but uh it does get progressively a bit faster, and the uh icon does move a little bit. I don't know. This is just the first one, so I guess that's why they're making it so easy for you, but I kind of like it, you know, it makes, I like that when my role-playing games have so many mini-games, however, there is a delicate balance, the core game needs to be fun first, and then these little additions can be good, but we won! What's our treasure? Something incredibly mediocre, but still useful, I guess, eh, later on in the game we're just gonna be able to get a lot more of these treasures though but uh hey there's a <laughs> a gravy sauce boat that's slick cool i guess I don't... why is this in the game i couldn't tell you treasure we did it, we did it nate uh... hey whisper looks like some sort of curry pot certainly seems that way doesn't it not the best treasure how strange it definitely looks valuable though see how shiny it is well let's go show mr box what we found yeah let's do it i guess or we could hold the hoard the treasure for ourselves. <laughs> no, we'll, we'll be good boys. And show it to him, I suppose. Hello there, sir. Check this out. Mr. Fox, we found some treasure. Well, well. Oh, I've still got an eye for true treasure and talent. I ain't time to put your feet up yet, though. 
Oh no, sorry, Bob. Why did you say that? <laughs> there's 20 totem treasure maps in total. T t 20 What? Man, yeah, there's another 19 treasures to track down and BBQ. May I just ask you to find out what's out waiting for you out there. I can't wait. That sounds like a lot, though. Say now, my fabulous friend. I'd be all grateful if you came to see you when you got them all. Because I got something mighty fine to give you as a reward. Uh-huh, like what? Well, you'll just have to wait and see, won't you? The thrill of discovery is what Treasant's all about, ain't it? See. That's a good way of putting it, I suppose. Well, next time then, sonny. Go on. Uh, thanks, mister. The man besotted by boxes has now been finished. Now on to the last quest. The last quest we gotta take care of is up here in the bay quarter of uh, North Beach. Hi there, mister. You run this establishment, I see. Welcome to Jungle Hunter. Always on the hunt for rare creatures. Yes. I swear there's a jungle hunter in Springdale too. How odd. Uh, you look almost exactly like the owner. That's Jungle Hunter's BBQ branch. So feel free to trade credits with me. Uh, you've opened a BBQ branch? That's right. Now I can deal with creatures from Springdale and BBQ. There's great fish to be had in BBQ, with many unique species to be caught. Cool, I'll have to give it a try. Oh no, I forgot my fishing rod when we moved here. Don't worry, kid, I'll give you a rod. <laughs> Perhaps you could fish me up a black bass in return. What? Well, that's really hard to fish. What? Well, how about it? Think you can manage that? I, uh, I guess I'll give it a shot. I knew you'd be game. Thanks, kid. Yeah, I'll give you my rod. Take good care of it. Don't break it or you owe me $50. Uh, okay, I'll try. Uh, gosh. Thanks. Whatever. Hey, thanks so much. I'll give this app, too. How do you... How can you give someone an app? What? Critter Collection. Critter Collection app records data of all the fishes and butches you get. But in a game where you can catch yokai, what's really the point in this? I, is that so? Well, take a look. And when I catch the black bass. I already can catch black bass from a river wister here. That's left on your map. Oh, and I'd rather have a normal black bass than a rare one, please. We did it! What an odd thing to say. Who wouldn't take a... Okay. What are you waiting for, Nate? Let's head over to the river. Cool. And... This is hands down the toughest quest of them all. Because fishing in this game is not as easy as you might think, okay? Either that or I'm just a little bit scarred from hunting fish in so many other parts of this game. Oh my gosh, it's... I'll try my best, y'all, but no promises, okay? <laughs> Walk west long enough, and you'll find this little patch of grass. Sort of in this forest area over here. This is where we're going to be able to catch that bass that I really want to get, because we cannot continue in the game without fishing. Yokai Watch is kind of funny like that, but uh, let's look in here. <gasps> there is one, and the fishing in this game is a little bit remixed from the previous games, but... It's still pretty darn easy. I like how the music fades out like that. So, basically, don't worry about, like, actually doing anything on the bottom screen as far as touch controls go. Just mash the A button. It's pretty easy. If you just keep it in the center, you won't break your line, and the fish also won't escape. Do that long enough, and a icon will show up where you just gotta mash the A button or reel as fast as you can. Personally, I just like pressing the A button. Oh, there it is. But, um, spinning the thing is a lot more thematic and on how actual fish work. That is a white bass. We need a black one. Crud. Hopefully this is a black bass. It looks like one. I I guess we'll find out. Come on, now. Get in there. Uh, uh, come on. Get in me. It's a black bass. But, John, it's green. Don't worry about it. That's just how fish are. <laughs> like, seriously. The, you guys would not... I'm not even going to get into that discussion. Because fish names are all over the place. And it's really, really odd. But if you can't manage to get the black bass at this location, pretty much anywhere around here, there are many different places to fish. However, if you're not really good at the mini game, all you got to do is exit North Beach, come back, and the fish should respawn. It's a little tedious, but don't worry. You don't need to fish that much in Yokai Watch. I'm walking here. Can you move, Mr. G's? I swear, man, nobody knows how to drive here. Ignore the fact that I was running in the middle of the road, but whatever. That fish looks like you got a black bass. Here you go. Have it, I guess. That's the one. There's a lot of these BBQ fish. They're so unique. You got nine jungle points for a normal bass. Jungle points, what, what? Oh, I'm sorry, of course I didn't explain them, did I? Well, accept any bugs or fish you catch. Instead of money, 
you get JP. More jungle points. Save up jungle points and you can buy neat stuff. Mostly things relating to yokai, and I shouldn't know what those are, but I still have them in stock. Kinda weird. I see. So if I fish up a bunch of fish, then I can trade them for points. How about trading that black bass in for some points? Sure. Here you go. Knock yourself out, mister. And with that, we are now done with all three key quests. What a pain. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, not my favorite part of the game. There's definitely better stuff on the way. Just saying. And now more story has been unlocked. Thanks, key quests, for keeping me out of that content for whatever reason. Uh, that's right. What's up, Nyan? I just remembered something. Mom said I've gotta go to Dad's new office. Where is it, Nyan? Let me check the note Mom gave me. I have the note here, let me see. Uh, it would appear your father's office is right here, North Beach. Oh yeah, what a coincidence. We'll head there right away, as soon as I've updated my blog. Well, Whisper, what are you doing, Nyan? Is this new social media app that's so popular these days? I see. Yeah, let's just leave him, Nyan. <laughs> yeah, later, Whisper. <laughs> can you give me a few minutes? I can just do it and walk. Anyway. Now we are required to switch the story over to Haley Ann in Springdale. But I don't want to do that yet, so we're going to hold off a little bit. And Yokai Watch 3 is divided into two stories, a girl's and a boy's. Story link occurs when two stories overlap. And if you don't swap your heroes, you'll miss out on vital clues that you might even get stuck. So you find yourself unsure where to go? Try swapping to the other hero. Most likely you'll find clues on how to progress in the other hero's story. So, you're basically required. So when hero switch shows up, head over to an IPO and swap over. So sorry, Dad, we gotta wait a little bit. Now we could technically progress the story as Nate for a little bit longer, but I don't wanna really do that right now. Instead, I'm gonna go check out that dream roulette a little more, okay? This time around, guys, we're gonna be searching for specifically yokai that you can get from these sushi coins. I'm gonna have the QR codes up right here. We're only gonna be using three, mainly because I wanna save some for a little bit later. I know I'm being really biased to Team Sushi, but you gotta make Team, Team Sushi won the contest, so you know, you know, this is fine because the yokai from this coin are pretty darn good, and I want one in particular, Snow Rabby. She's like one of my favorite designs. Let's hope we get her. Let's spin the wheel. The sushi coin, for those who aren't aware, comes from scanning a QR code that comes with a free coin that you got in Japan if you purchase the deluxe version or actual, oh my gosh, we're gonna get a gold! Yes, if you got Yokai Watch physical, you got a coin, and if you scare the QR code, you can get se, se, se. Sergeant Spect here, oh my god. Secret, oh, I, I don't know what her name is, but oh my gosh, she's so cute, I love her. Together at last. I've been looking forward to meeting you for so long. Same here. Snow spit hair. <laughs> She's so cute. She is really strong as well. Snow Spectair is a secret agent yokai, and she's also really, really powerful. She's a mysterious tribe, S rank, and I am okay with that. Holy crud. For those who aren't aware, rare or yokai usually deal a lot more damage in battle, and so... Oh my gosh, her name's all over the place. Spectair, as I'll just call her for, you know, convenience sake, is a really strong one. Uh, for the rest of these, I already, I already got the gold, so we're just gonna kind of abridge it. Do we get another gold? No, we got another red capsule. That's okay with me. I guess, wait, this might be something. Oh. Does anybody want to trade a Strabignon? No? Okay, then. Bummer. Last coin, come on! I need a new pair of shoes! That's not even a joke, I just, re I just really need a new pair of shoes. My, my, my other ones have holes in them. Yes, I got another gold! Okay, hopefully we get another rare yokai. Something good, baby! And it's <gasps> Thurston! Heck yes, dude! Not American yokai, but he's a classic and he is a boss. Holy crud. Drink, drink. Let's drink to my freedom. Sport drinks, of course. <laughs> you say so. Thurston is a Japanese yokai based on a oni of all things named Shuten Doji. His name might sound familiar for those 
well versed in mythology, but he is another mysterious yokai and is an absolute powerhouse, man. He's one of the stronger yokai that you can get from this crank, so I'm happy about that. And you know more than any crank guy for the day. Peace out. With the dream roulette starts over. Okay, so. Before we swap over to Halion in the next episode, oh my gosh, we we gotta check these guys out. Holy crud. Oh man, the legend pages. There's one for sushi, there's one for tempura, and skiaki. How about that? But uh, where the crud are these guys, actually? Oh, well, there they are. They're on the same exact page. So let's first start off with Thurston, a demon lord once bested by humans. Now a strict training regimen keeps him on a steady diet of healthy foods, and drinks? Okay. Critical attack guarantee for the first attack made. That's so strong, dude. But man, I love this guy's design and what he's like is in mythology. It's just so cool. So, oh my gosh, look at up, look up Shuten Doji if you could spell it. But um, let's check out Snow Rabbit Spectair, a yokai that houses the feelings of a child crying over the fading snow. Okay, that's weird. Restores innocence to the hearts of those she meets. Make water element critical attacks likely for allies. Wow, that's super strong. Snow Spectator. Snow Spectator. You can't see it, but she actually like throws uh, playing cards as a weapon. And I happen to really like trading cards. Or uh, not, <laughs> yeah, I like trading cards. But also playing cards as just a motif. She's so stinking cool. And the artwork on like American Legend, or not American uh, Legend, but just American Metals as a whole are so awesome. I want to check out his as well, just because a classic yokai medal looks actually way different than American one, and same with the, you know, more traditional yokai, such as Jabanyan, who, uh, yeah, is kind of, a uh, he's old school at this point, you also know what his yokai medal looks like, but man, I'm so happy they put this, like, part in the game, because I love the yokai medal artwork and all that stuff, but anyways, guys, in the next episode of Yokai Watch 3, it's time we send things over to Halian back in Springdale, and hopefully get her some strong yokai too. So thanks again, hope you all enjoyed our hunt for pizza, fish, and boxes. Kind of a weird part, but oh well. See you guys next time, more videos. Bye.